there, there, there's a myth that says once you get saved, your problems go away. But just get saved, give your life to the Lord, and you will be problem free. So pastor has been graciously preaching and teaching on the topic, discovering your purpose. And we all have been, been blessed by that, by that word. Amen. Amen. Um, this Sunday, he talked on check your equipment. Amen. Um, because we all are packing with something for the glory of God. Response is that lost it all, some would say. But how we respond to life troubles will dictate how soon we get to where we need to be. Because some of us have a way of complaining, grumbling, why this had to happen to me, why me, Lord? Why me, Lord? There's nothing wrong with asking God a question. That's not wrong with asking God a question. Just be prepared for the answer. But when the bread is taken off, the sandwich, no one buys a sandwich that looks like this. I promise you, if you would have purchased this he would have went right back and said, you all got to do something. And don't give me this one back. <laughs> give me another one. Because no, no, no one likes when their life gets killed upon. No, no, no one likes when, when, when the spouse loses a job. No, no one likes when, 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 what was once a beautiful sandwich now gets peeled apart because life has its way of doing things on purpose. But it's hard for us to, to really see the big picture because we were so used to having fun when it was a full sandwich. So here is Joe who had seven sons, three daughters, $20 million until one day life happened. Life happened. How do we respond when life Indeed, the Lord gave Job twice as much as he had before. Job decided to pray for those friends who felt like he must have done something wrong for this to happen that happened in his life. Maybe God is punishing you, Joe, because, because everybody thinks you saved, but you ain't all that saved. You ain't all that saved. Oh, thank you, saved, Joe. But ain't no way in the world you don't lose all of this and you saved. Maybe you doing something that ain't nobody else. Nobody else know. Because stuff just don't happen to save folk. Save folk don't just lose their business when they tithe it. That don't happen to save folk. Huh? <laughs> that, that, that don't happen to save folk, Joe. So Joe, what did you do, Joe? Because you 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 lost twenty million dollars and your children. But you got a relationship with God. You got church folk talk. You got church folk talk. When when stuff started. Shaking in your house. Right? But well, he ain't living right. Oh, oh, oh. She, she ain't living right. I, I, oh, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I, 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 I see what he posts on Facebook, but that house ain't in order. <laughs> so it has to be 
ain't something, Job, that you're doing behind closed doors because there is no way this is going to happen to you. And Job could have, he could have, he could have got so upset. His wife told him, curse God. Who wants, you know, already lost your children. Who wants to live with a spouse like that? Just curse God. But his response, he worshiped God and he prayed for his hand.